All right. Um, this is our second time trying to record this video. Whatever. Uh, don't use NVIDIA overlay. That shit sucks. Okay, so I want to, I want to, like, do a lot more thoughtful analysis of, like, fingerboarding in general. So I thought, what better way to do that than a tier list? I have some brands here that I think represent the majority of the... <laughs> Fingerboard culture. Fingerboard right fingerboard industry, I guess. Yeah, industry right now. When it comes to oh, I didn't even put I didn't even put catfish barbecue in there. Hold on. This is embarrassing. Okay. Um so this is basically like the brands that I think represent uh represent finger the fingerboard industry like in a general broad like synopsis of what's going on. First off, we're starting out with dumb one. I don't think you're gonna find any graphics better they're like the top of the food chain it's like at like y2k uh like early 2000s graffiti looking designs right a lot of stuff going on in the graphics it looks like like these are actually made by real artists like somebody made these like graphics tons of thought when it comes to like theme style overall image of the brand like the this this is like the top the most top tier art direction i've ever seen in a fingerboard company there is no one i mean catfish barbecue i'd say is like right there with it the black ply right there black the, ply yeah that's fire yeah the zipper zipper the pink on the on the, bl yeah, on the black the contrast fire. very sick the aesthetic of um, this brand is very um authentic that's so sick i love these yeah, the uh, tech deck. Yeah, like, the the focus on, like, the baggy, like, early 2000s kind of the... Just Y2K. Digital age, I guess. Um, there's a graphic I wanted to point out. Yeah, this one, like, yeah. look at the details. Yeah. Insane. You're not going to find anything like this in a fingerboard company. That's a cool graphic. That's so, the everything, rats. Dude, like everything, the rats. everything is so sick. Look at this little, like, doorway. This one's called the cockroach, the roach, and... Oh, that's funny. Like, the cockroaches are making up the... They're, yeah, and they're, like, crawling out of... Like, dude, the attention to detail and packaging as well. He does a Priority Mail USPS uh, sticker label. He draws on them, and he does, like, custom it's drawings for every order. A few nitpicks I have. This is hard to explain. This picture explains it perfectly, but... Uh, so there's, like, certain... There's certain ways you can, like route or like route the shape of your board and depending on what template you use uh you can either account for like the dips of the kicks and like make sure the kicks are flush with how you're rounding it instead of it being like kicked up and rounding it if this is making sense this picture explains my pet peeve because you can kind of see the edge on here it's like angled it's like perpendicular to the f surface because they just kind of took the board, just did a quick pass around, and they were like, that's good. <laughs> to me, that's like, you're just showing how you could have gone even further with the quality. And so, I don't know. In, in like, reality, it it's, like, not a huge deal, of course. No, no. But that's something that I've seen, like, other board companies don't have this problem, so I'm like, why couldn't you just, like, go the extra extra little few minutes and just, like, make that a little better? Again, inconsequential thing. Um, it's at least F tier. <laughs> like, you can kind of see... Th this guy, Sam, is incredible, by the way. He's such... He's so good. But, like, some of these... Like, you can kind of see how mellow this deck is. Mine that I have... Uh, the molds are kind of different. Like, I've seen different kinds of molds. I could be completely uneducated on this subject, but for the most part, Dumb One is pristine. The gra the art direction is incredible. There's just a few inconsistencies in, like, the quality that bug me just a little bit. And because of that, they, they're in the A tier. They could be S. They could be S. S is, like, without flaw. They could be S, but there are just a couple things that kind of bug me. Thoughts? No, A is good. I was going to say A or B. Yeah. Top of the A. B, A tier, for sure. Next up, a complete 180. <laughs> <laughs> Famous decks. Famous decks. Um, you know, I appreciate... I appreciate Famous for, like, what they provide in the sense of, like, you can buy a whole-ass setup from this website. Nah. 
that's pretty that's pretty invaluable like i can just go in here i can buy wheels i can buy trucks and i can buy a deck i got a complete in one place that's cool i appreciate appreciate that a lot uh what i don't appreciate um or the fucking graphics. <laughs> i wouldn't stuff, i wouldn't dude. you know i wouldn't be surprised if that was ai as well yeah i don't know i mean this is like like there's it's so polygonic like it's just like someone could have made that but i guarantee yeah. you i'm just gonna go with that i'm just gonna say that it's probably ai yeah, cause like look at the look at the way this shape kind of blends yeah. into this shape here. Yeah, it's, it's just probably AI. very. Like yeah, this, this one's definitely AI. Like this. like without a doubt. Like because look at the look at the dude with the ant. Yeah. What even is this fucking? You can board, also bro? just you can also just like tell like look yeah. at this picture. You can just tell it. it's just AI. Like, no, also, no one's gonna just intentionally draw the third <laughs> this yeah. third little antler here. Like, and it's also uneven between the two. I'm not familiar with the uh, anatomy of uh, what is this? An, is it, an, it's a, an elk? It's a, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It's a fucking deer. I don't it's know. A deer. I just know that it's AI just from the way it looks, and then also like what's going on with the the dude has an antler on his shoulder as well. Yeah, what's going on with that? I don't like know. Random as I, hell. I guess it's supposed to be like a because he didn't just take it off of that. Yeah, is that his like partner in crime? They're hunting deer together. I don't know. It's like fine antlers. That's definitely what's, AI. What's the what, what's the meaning? Like, are they partners? I, also, also look how much larger this animal is to this person. Oh yeah, true. I didn't even really realize. This is like that. that's a huge deer. <laughs> that's <laughs> like, insane, that's dude. A gigantic deer. I don't know if that even is a deer. We could go all day. Like, it's just AI. Like, and just like laziness. the elephant one. Elephant, like definitely AI. These feet, like that's just so weird looking, and like this trunk. Yeah, I don't know. It's no, it's it's, it's AI. AI. Yeah, that. So this board's, uh, it's cool. It like the stars at the bottom and like whatever like chaotic nonsense is going on at the bottom is sick. I like that. The skull with like the the. It's pretty badass. It's pretty badass. It's like ironic. Yeah, it's cool. cool. It's like Y two K looking. Like yeah, the green at the top could be changed or, or to a different color. Probably something like like black or maybe if they just took the stars and put them up there as well, I think it would complete the board. Get rid of that fucking F logo, whatever. The, <laughs> that it's diamond. Just, that's terrible. Yeah, that's bad. That's so bad. That's really bad. I like that board. That's a cool board. I think the <laughs> at first we were looking at this and was like, oh, that's whack. And then I like bl- blew it up a little more and we we're like, hold on. Yeah, because cool. at first, when I first seen it, I was like, what the fuck is this? And then yeah. we actually clicked on it. I was like, actually, that's kind of a cool It's graphic. kind of approaching kind of that, like, that dumb one territory. Yeah, it's exactly. Like a lot of detail. Yeah. Um, but I would just change the colors. Like, make all this black. I don't know. I don't need this. I don't. I, need, like, I like the blue. I don't need... It, like, oh, gives yeah. off, it gives off, like, early 2000s, like, gothic scene yeah. girl vibe. Also, why is this K not here? I have no here? idea. I don't know. Like, put it, just, put it here. Just get rid of it. Dang, he got the Dude. saver. He couldn't. He couldn't save up ten extra dollars to get I, the, <laughs> like it's to get 30, arguably 40. a shittier graphic. <laughs> arguably Damn. a shittier graphic. In yeah, my that, I would much rather have this. I than would. The other ones. I would have. I would. Wait, why I are like they so S. much cheaper? I like this S. So what they do is they. Is they, it a graphic? They make them the same way, but they they uh, do less with like the lacquering and like the quality of the real wear graphic. So they're just they half as it. Kind of, Wait, and, so but it's it's less. If you want, just it's ten more dollars, bro. Yeah. To just get, I guess, a better board. I don't know if these are actually I mean, good or not. Kinda Hold like on. S- what the fuck is that? <laughs> what the fuck is that? Yeah. Like, this is how I know all their other designs are AI made. Yeah. Because that's just, all their other designs are so simple, and like there's no creativity behind anything that they just have to use AI to make other designs. But, I mean, look like, at what this. Like, what the fuck dude. is what this, What is bro? this, dude? <laughs> It's terrible. I mean, I don't know. Some Rob Deerdick shit. It's right just kind of like there's a sense of like no central like image or like identity. Yeah, like they're, they're making just... everything for everybody, uh, and like yeah, I don't know. Uh, they rotate graphics a lot too. So like if you don't really like the ones that are here, you're probably not gonna like the next ones that are coming <laughs> out. Uh, D. Yeah, I was D gonna say D. That one graphic yeah. with the with the the king on it, yeah. or whatever the king skull. It that's kind of it's it's that saved the redeeming factor. Yeah. Uh, this next one, LC boards. Oh, fucker. This is okay. We're entering like this is definitely for like beginners, kids who want to get into stuff. But like this is just screaming MS Paint. Uh, I'm just gonna pick a font. Find a swirly image on Google. Put the font on there. I'm not assuming. I'm just assuming. I am assuming. Whoever this person is that made this brand, 
I guarantee you, and I'm not trying to, I'm not trying to be like, oh, body shame or anything, but they're probably like middle aged, you know, probably 35, 40 yeah, years old. Yeah. They're into fingerboarding, but they're into like LSD as well. <laughs> They're, mushrooms and like, uh, yeah, like yeah, shrooms yeah, yeah. and, and shit. They're like, and they're like I in the mountain. Yeah, exactly. Uh, whatever. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But my third eye. Or, or <laughs> let's, what if we do like an Arizona can on the bottom of a fingerboard? Yeah. Like, oh, I know what potheads love. SpongeBob. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, well, I don't understand. There's definitely a cease and desist waiting at his doorstep for sure. If I were like twelve, I would be all over this. All right, like a complete for eighteen dollars. That's like really attractive to yeah. someone who's like thirteen. This one's not too bad. Yeah, I actually. Kinda this like kind of reminds me of like old revive graphics. Like they had like the spots, like famous spots on a board. But for what it is, I like that graphic. That graphic's cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. The Hollywood sixteen. Yeah. The, it's basically just like a get everything here kind of beginner place for what it is. It's, I don't know. D. D. Bottom of the yeah. D. Next up, flat face. Iconic OG brand that we're talking about I here. I didn't really made decks. I think this one is sick. The, the they did a funeral collab. Oh, that's cool. Very sick. I like that. The I I think this is like. A very good logo. No, their logo's ass. You don't like it? No, hell no. You don't like it? No, because it's reminding me of the the FF logo. The, oh. The, uh, what's it called? I don't know, dude. What's it called? Uh, Fallen. Fallen yeah, footwear. Yeah, yeah. Get the shit out of here, bro. It's just ass. No, nah, dude. I, uh, that's where we disagree. It's, it's very... Too, it's too just... Anyway, um, these, these decks are highly esteemed for their molds. Um, by the way, I've never tried one of these, but these things just look insane to me. Like, good? Look at how... No. I mean... Like the... I've never you, tried one. Are you talking about the nose and the tail? Just look at how ins- insane the shape looks. Like, yeah. no concave. The kicks are, like, <laughs> to the roof. I get what Mike's trying to do. He, like, wants to unlock the perfect shape for the the easiest board to ride they're pretty high quality from what i've heard but i've also seen like horror stories with these decks like i've seen i've seen someone where their holes were like drilled over here oh no that's and fucking their, bad their bro. truck was like ha- hanging on for dear life <laughs> so i've i've heard a lot of quality control issues with flat face and mike's process with all this i think his wheels and his decks are like kind of held at the same level um, I've only I've only heard good stuff about the 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 wheels. The wheels I, I didn't even know yeah. they made decks yeah. until now. So I might be pissing at some people off. <sighs> they just I don't know. For what they are and like looking at the decks, they don't really speak to me personally. I don't no. know how you feel. No, except okay. for that funeral collab, it's kind of cool. The fu- yes, props for connecting with a brand like that, but also I don't know. I would get that deck, but I don't think I would get. Because I think that one is actually on a funeral deck. It's not on a flat face deck. Oh, okay. Yeah, C. I'm fine with C. Is it like C's a C.5? <laughs> Next one, Joy, Joy Colt. I am a fan of their wheels. I have four sets, personally. I think they're great, but you're, this is, that's the only reason why you're here, I think. Is that an AI? I don't know. We're going to get into that. We're going to get into okay. that. We're not just looking at the decks. We're kind of also just looking at, like, their... Just- Overall art direction. Yeah, I would say like the overall. Um, They're aesthetic. Yeah, so... <sighs> oh my god, that's AI. <laughs> yes. Damn, that's yes. AI. Let's that's crazy. Let's go to crazy. their website, actually. Wow, this, that's bad. This is, like, blatant, just... That's straight he up. Put this, he put this on Instagram when the, this drop came out, and everyone was like, take this shit down, dude. Like, everyone in the yeah. comments was like... That's bad, like, This dude. is unacceptable. This is awful. This is ludicrous. This is this is this is Diddy, bro. This is Diddy. You better order me a double XL right now. Oh, that's annoying. It doesn't zoom. Um, good. I don't want to look at this any longer. <laughs> um, <laughs> I is, really like this one. I really I hope it's think, not AI. I don't think it is. I think it's a real. I think it's a real plushie. Okay. With the hat, because the hat. Look the 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 new is it new era? I don't know anything about cat, bro. I don't cat. Yeah. Anyway. All right. Okay. <laughs> that looks like it's a real hat. Yeah, because well, it mean, is an actual hat. It just like release. like you know how you look at AI and you're like, that's, that's right. AI. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that yeah. doesn't look like AI. Yeah, I mean, there's nothing to really crack the case open on. Like it's just it's blatant. So, uh, we're not we're just gonna get into the decks. Uh, 
Eh. That's cool. I mean, if you just want a plain... It looks really professional. Yeah, very like professional. Pl- Something like this, it's cool. I think camo is, like, starting to become a little played out okay. lately. The camo is sick. The font they chose for that is fucking horrendous. Yeah. Weed! Weed. Fuck off! <laughs> yeah, clown world. Like, all this is just right. kind of, like... It's kind of like stoner culture. I prefer the old, like, Sega Genesis type weed logo that oh, they the had. the original? The original. Yeah. I don't know why they chose to, like, I guess gentrify it. I don't know. They probably didn't want to bring them back because Sanitize it was so it. original. Yeah, but, like, he has all the assets to this company now. Right. Company now. I feel like no one would have an issue. Obviously, you're here for the wheels. The wheels are, like, the most unique wheels I've ever ever seen cool picture. yeah uh, the uh, sea. bottom of the sea i would i would rather skate a flat face deck and wear flat face clothing than joy cult clothing <laughs> <laughs> all right we're getting into funeral now um let's go uh i kind of like the old tv like crtv kind of aesthetic of like this pro stop <laughs> i'm just giving you options yeah. for when you put the noise yeah I kind of, I kind of like the. It's like early two thousand. The CRTV like kind of aesthetic of this, where it's kind of, it looks like this would just be like, on like a screen. These graphics are cool. Same, like that same thing right there. Like Fire. Kind of. Fire. This is. Them. I like always like actual images. Yeah, on like mixed media, kind of like digital art mixed with like real yeah. pictures. Uh, 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 graphic by Pac. Pac, good job. Pac, yeah. I don't know who you are, Pac. Good very job. Good. This one. It's by Pac. By Pac. All these are probably by Pac. Uh, it's all right. Um, I like that one. That's... It's okay. I like it. It's maybe too simple. A little too simple, maybe. Yeah, that one. This Sorry. one. Guess. Yeah, that's a good... I like... I like that logo. Again, companies who, like, reinvent their logo and yeah. kind of just, like, implement it in different ways. And then, yeah, that one's gas, too. Yeah. I, really I like, like this one. etched one, too. I like this one a lot. I, yeah, it's Skull. like... It just looks sketchy. And then a Barbie doll. That's <laughs> it's cool. Just, Dumb One does this, too, uh, where they, like... They don't have a set logo. They okay. kind of implement it into their graphics naturally. Right. Um, this one is straight up just a hockey graphic. Oh, yeah, um, it is. <laughs> I love this idea i was gonna say what is this it's literally just a heat transfer white graphic i don't know why i love that i just like that it's like is there like a logo on there or no no it's just okay, white. it's just a blank board I, and I whatever think that's, applies underneath it i think that's like simple like simplicity done in a cool way but holy I think, they have a ton of holy options. shit they do i like funeral yeah but i don't think they beat um dumb one dumb one i think dumb I one dumb one's at the top I agree. Well, you can put them on A, but it's, like, yeah, below. Yeah, there might be top of the B. <laughs> okay. Uh, I don't know. Top of the B might be good. Behind dumb one. Behind dumb one. All right. Next up, false alarm. I have a personal bias toward false alarm because I have discovered their decks in the past few months. Uh, I should say Quentin's deck. By the way, insane skateboarder. It's a shame he broke yeah. his leg. That like, dude, that motherfucker is crazy. This dude. If you can put the clip of him doing that nolly laser flip over the trash oh, can. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. From what I understand, False Alarm's motto is perfectly imperfect. So that tells you all you need to know. That you're not getting a highly polished, highly uh, streamlined kind of deck. You're getting like some homemade raw shit. That he just, he, he, basically this is what he wants to make. His, his love for, like, making things definitely shines through, <laughs> through his products. That, that board with yeah. the, him smoking out the bottom. Classic. Bar. This one's cool. Just, again, kind of, he, he has a, an infatuation with caricatures in his graphics. This is a classic one, too. Oh, yeah, the, the drum, drum set. set. So far. Uh, he plays guitar. Yeah, he does. These are just so good dang those are fire yeah this is what i'm talking about though where it's like kind of homemade and raw like this stuff doesn't line up like yeah. it doesn't go on on yeah. the edge like i would prefer but a deck that had something like this it kind of it kind of adds to it though it's like it, it's the charm of it i would say authentic i just really i really love what false alarm is doing um they just came out with a new mold if you didn't know these decks are long they're like yeah. <laughs> 103, 102 millimeters long. Like yeah. your average deck is going to be like 97 millimeters long. 
and he just came out with a new mold. Uh, this is 97. Um, oh, sweet. Still mellow. Let me just say this personally. I, I have three setups, false alarm setups. These, this... You have three false alarms? Yeah. Damn, that's a lot. This mold and the, the wheelbase has, like, completely changed my outlook on fingerboarding. I used to hate long boards. I, like, wanted 30, 36 millimeter. Like, I don't care about the wheelbase. Didn't even think about the wheelbase. And then I was, was like, you know what? I'm going to try one out. Just completely transformed, like, how I approach fingerboarding. It's so much more realistic... Like, this has a closer proportion to a real skateboard than, like, any other fingerboard you'll see, in my opinion. I, I used to be a 34-millimeter guy. I'm now a 30- and 32-millimeter guy and longer wheelbase. It's because I feel like the longer decks provide a more realistic feeling. It just feels really good. You have to try one to, like, know what I'm saying. But another thing that I like is that the graphics don't wear off super quick, so you can, like, enjoy the graphic. Oh, that's cool. That's pretty cool. Again, like, real art. <laughs> yeah, literally real art. Real art, real thought put into this stuff. Uh, Green Day bootleg, super sick. Yeah, he, he actually is a Green Day fan. I really like this aesthetic of, like, it's low effort, but he's, like... I think you explained it. It's perfectly imperfect. It's perfectly imperfect, and that that's, like, the perfect motto to that's, that's explain. Thing. That's their thing. Though. Yeah, so I'm going... I'm going to go... I think I'm going above Dumb One on this one. Really? Yeah. What do you think? Um, it's like right there. I really can't say because I've never fingerboarded a. I've never fingered a Both <laughs> dumb of them? one or false. Yeah. Actually, I have false alarm. Yeah, yeah. And I'm not a fan because I like the shorter boards. Yeah. Um, we'll get to that in a minute with DK, but um, um, they're like right there. So I would say, as like aesthetically pleasing, I would I like dumb one. But I like their graphics more than False Alarm. You he's can great, tell he's a great guy. Yeah. I just I just like these designs more. That's the only thing that's like these ones more. Yeah, that's the only thing that's like holding me between both of them. There is a clear there is a clear distinction of like effort being put into the art. That's like the this brand's thing where it's like yeah. it's just raw. He's making what he wants to make. He's having fun with it. So I think what I was trying to say here is that there is a distinction between Dumb One and False Alarm. But the thing is, they're just two completely different companies. Dumb One's doing their thing. False Alarm's doing their thing. No discredit to anyone's art direction. I think they're both sick. I think I wasn't... I think I was just not getting my point across correctly. They're, they're two completely different brands. So comparing them that way is a little unfair. But, uh, yeah, False Alarm is... Very sick, so don't get it twisted. But it's cool. I I do like the aesthetic a lot. These are sick. <laughs> yeah, I know. I just you know these the, are funny. These are fucking gas. Yeah, false alarm. It's like right there. These are like I would. Yeah, I would yeah. say yeah, definitely above funeral. All right. Um. Again, whole ass one eighty on these ones, but <laughs> slush colt. They're obviously. They are a carrier. They carry all sorts. See, they have false alarm decks here. Okay, gotcha. Worm. Uh, this is obviously not why you're coming to Slush Cold. What? Boards. Hold on. Why did I think their graphics were going to be way worse than this? Here's the thing. This is essentially a cow ply graphic. Um, so that's not really... They're kind of like just ripping a, a different style. Because I've seen their other, their other graphics, and there's some shitty fucking yeah. graphics. So that's a straight up a cow ply. I don't think it's a cow ply collab. It doesn't say anything. Um, so that's a little weird, a little concerning. Obviously they're carrying a whole bunch of other brands. That's why you're here, I think. So, but if we're being fair, we're going to look at their own work. Dude, honestly, I mean, this one's all right. That one's all right. Um, this one is kind of, that one's ass. Yeah. It's just like too rainbow pukey to me. Like it's just. I fucking hate that. This one's yeah, that's abysmal. Horrendous. Abysmal. This one's like kind of better, but I, I hate that one. I, I would not want an FA anything related. They sell slush coal on um, Zoomies. Oh yeah, yeah. That's uh, an automatic. <laughs> yeah. Um. It's suck me. So they, Hell no. That's I don't fucking know like shit, why bro. why false alarm holster. Hell Shout yeah. Out. Shout out. Quentin's getting his bag. Slush coal makes the best fingerboard tape 
Okay. Ever. I've never tried. They have. They do have that. This pyro wheels. Cl- I my eyes are burning looking at these. Uh, <laughs> Damn. Cool concept. I just don't know if I would uh, personally ride those, but I do like pyro wheels a lot. That's just a lot to me. Um, sold some out, their, obviously. Some of the graphics are pretty cool. Yeah. Um, the only thing that's like really like uh, bothering me is that they do sell on zoomies. Yeah. Um, I really, I just, I just don't like zoomies like that. Yeah. What if, are we thinking? Uh, I was thinking probably bottom of C. Mm, I think they're here. Top Why of do you D. think that? I don't know. I th- Personally, I can't speak to the quality of the decks, but I also know that, like, I don't have experience with them, but I've also heard, like, they're just not good quality okay. decks. I mean, I like, don't care. You can put it on a D. I'm thinking top of the D just because, like, I don't think I would personally skate any of those okay. graphics. Finger any of those graphics. I'm just going to say skate. <laughs> That's all. Let's... I don't think I'd finger any of those graphics. I'm not going to finger any of those. All right. Uh, we're almost done. <laughs> Wait, actually... No, it's going in the my mom just bought me a tech deck two weeks ago. I totally forgot about this section. Yeah, that's funny. Uh, Elsie's going in there too. <laughs> forgot I even made Elsie's this. Elsie deserves, deserves to go on the bottom though. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yes. Elsie's like I agree. like straight up. I agree. Yeah, I totally forgot I made that tier. Uh, so something's got to go in the F. I don't know. I don't have to. Yeah. Unless we do one of these. Yeah. Let's do that. Yeah. So both of those are like, oh, finger boarding. <laughs> finger boating why should mom, i go to buy a finger boat my mom did yeah yeah exactly, exactly. yeah I, i'll see sk- lc boards and yeah, slush call yeah, would be yeah. like my first place to yeah. go to if i needed to complete I'm, I'm i'm digging the list so far next up nothing is in the s yet but that will change soon delhi decks at a glance i'm just very overwhelmed is like a good word i would say like yeah, there's a lot going on all <laughs> the colors so many colors all right, all right, all right, all right. first graphic not yeah. bad. Not too bad. <laughs> it's it's just... pretty ass. Second graphic, ass. Yeah. Third graphic, fire. Easily their best graphic. That's their best graphic. Easily, without Is that doubt. the carbon fire reward, too, or no? The the polycarbonate. Yeah, that one. Yeah. Is that is that the one right there? Yes. That's so gas. And the orange Very is Very cool. Very cool. You can pick your... Uh, I like the orange. That's fire. Plastic color. Like, this is the direction they need to go, because their whole thing is, like, deli storefronts like deli stores yeah. like food kind of thing like, like this yeah. is a bag you would take out if you bought something from a deli shop this is cool it's like 26 dollars. yeah very affordable very i highly recommend yeah you had decks. that board i did have you? this i do it was a different shape though no no it was the same shape was the same? okay it's like an egg shape fire graphic i would also argue that this one is pretty good too the graphic yes nah but what do you think nah why? It's just ass, bro. I think it's just like, it's just, it's just ass. Like I don't like it. It's just, it's yeah. just bad. I don't like it. I can, yeah. It's too like. There's nothing wrong with this, but to me, to me, it's just too like. I'm a 35 year old man that owns a business, and I need to put. It, How about this? The yeah. front of a the front of a deli store that says deli. You know, it's so it's very on the nose and like not creative. You know what I'm saying? They just threw it on the bottom of the board. Yeah. But at least it's not AI. I, as yes. far as I know, I, at least it's not AI. I don't think it is I AI. I don't think it's AI. I could be very wrong. Uh, I mean, those bricks kind of look a little weird right there. Um, I mean, it could just been like a, a um, picture they took and then added it. Yeah. Down, you know? But I personally think this is like what they're going for, which also, okay, this logo is like not, I don't know. I like the logo. It is cool, but I don't think it matches, like... Their aesthetic? Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't. Um, that that thank you bag stuff they're going for? Yeah, that's, that's, that's what they need to go That's fire. For. Like, I, this shit's ass. Go back. It's, like, you know... This that, is just... You know the Amazon TV or whatever? Like, the... Uh, or the, the Roku City? Yeah, the Roku City. That's <laughs> what I'm talking about. That's what that reminds yeah, me exactly. of. Yeah, exactly. They motherfucker put a Roku City on the bottom of the board. <laughs> um, just, like really playing it safe like th- th- again this is like for the vast majority of people like that last one was fucking horrendous the uh no, no, no go up this one yeah yeah that is terrible. i mean i don't know dude what the fuck <laughs> that's bad bro. it's just too much it's too much my argument for this one is i say it's closest to what i think they should like lean into which is like actually the, the relating jelly. it to like 
deli stuff. Right, yeah. I would even, easily skate that. Even like a, I think what would be cool to go up there. See their see their logo. Yeah. The deli, how it's like the shape of a, mm-hmm. like a cow's body. Yeah. Legs and a yeah, head, yeah, yeah. and it says deli it as like a, a body. Cow. It's like a cow, you know. That would I don't be know cool. something to do with like food. D- this one's fire. This one is fire. Oh yeah, the credit card fire. one. Fire. Yeah, I like that. So sick. Like they need to do stuff like this, like. A, a card you'd pay with just i don't know i think i think it's pretty cool parroting like everyday things that we interact with is secure as fuck yeah that it's so it's so sick it really on the nose with like the 42069 stuff i think it's ironic i think it's funny member since 2015 probably when they started right yeah uh probably. valid through not a valid date um just really it's a funny I think it looks cool too i think green was a very good choice for this another reason why i think the credit card graphic is really sick is because it's essentially like not only is it an image of a credit card but it's actually like pretty much the same size as a credit card so it's like furthering that parody of like real world things um because you could essentially like put this in your wallet which i think is really funny but what i also think is really smart is the image of a credit card i think really excites people because like the only reason why you're pulling out a credit card is to like buy something so it instantly like makes you think of spending money regardless of if that's a smart choice or not when you spend money it feels good so and the fact that it's green too like that ultimately reminds you of money of course and so i think that just like further like secures this graphic as being like a really really smart choice because i think it's it just works so well and i think it's really cool um so yeah do more of that that would be sick. Delhi, I'm going to go... Those three graphics are, like, good to me, but everything else is kind of holding it back. I'd say it's top of the C tier. What do you think? B. B? Yeah. Yeah. I think they have a lot of potential. Yeah. Uh, with If they just put out better graphics, I think they could easily be one of the, the best fingerboard brands. Yeah. Uh, I mean, they're, I think their logo is great. Like Because it, it's like that, like blocky graffiti almost yeah i'm saying that leans into that like y2k aesthetic they just really have to clean up some of their stuff and if they're gonna go for like realistic looking designs it needs to be more stuff like this. yes i totally agree bro what are we doing (laughs) what is this that's bad this is just abysmal i don't mind this one that one's all right that one's okay um i think it's a little too simple yeah but also they let's what else is there yeah, these are all just bad. Like, just make it a sandwich. Why do what I need? What the fuck is that? Why bro? do I need this oil spill design? Uh, I don't and, need any of that. And like, look, there's people on yeah, top of the sandwich. I don't know. That's cool. They also sell wheels. Um, and my God, if I were to just get a full deli setup, I think I would have a seizure. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, actually, hold on. That pink one is the, sick. The pink border is cool. It kind of it's kind of like a dipped board. Yeah, that's uh, sick. I actually really like that pink. Definitely a ton of potential. Um, B tier, I think, is well deserved. DK. Um, okay, bro. <laughs> we don't have to. We don't have to really d- dive deep. This is this is the the blue collar working man kind of fingerboard company. Yeah. You're paying fifty dollars for. A, a complete um and i will say these wheels are good the dk wheels the dk wheels yeah i got I have my my first and are, only pair yeah. of wheels i've ever had are dk wheels yeah and i still am rocking them right now these are very good for the price you're getting these wheels in a complete 30 bucks for the wheels 50 for the board and the trucks as well yeah like Minus Inc- the graphic, but Min- yeah, I mean that's not Bro. why we're here. That's not why <laughs> yes, we're here. It is. I mean the it is, but a part of the board. But DK, I've had like four DK yeah. setups in the past. My first because, board was a DK. Yes, I feel like a lot of people would also be saying the same thing. Yeah, my my fingerboard right now is a DK. Yeah, um, a lot of these graphics are like, holy shit, what the fuck's going on? <laughs> I do actually really like uh, these ones, yes. but they have a black one. That uh, it's probably down here somewhere that I really want. Oh, oh yeah, right this there. One. 
Yeah, it's. I, I don't know if it's that one actually. It might be the colors might be a little different yeah. on the middle, but I really do like that one. I know it's like the fucking awesome ripoff. Yeah. But like this bomb one too, is so fire. Very cool. This one is. Oh excellent. yeah. Our, uh, our friend Jalen. Yeah, Jalen has that one. A so there's like gems too. in the middle of like. Uh, whatever fucking shit this is. Yeah, what the fuck is this shit? Uh, Braille's calling. This stuff is just not good at all. You, your finger, if you're fingering that shit, bro, you're talking <laughs> to minors. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> this is kind of ooh. The, I actually whoa. Nah. I kind of like the motion oh, of wait, what's I happening here. I didn't see that it was a, it was a character. I thought it was just yeah. shapes. I like it a lot more that it is I like a character. I do like that one. Um, they also. Offer a ton of options. Yeah, Can that fucking cat ice cream one is terrible. Yeah, just that's we're awesome. We're back in dude. slush cult territory. Yeah, we're back in terrible, Deli Dex bro. territory. That's... But we can both attest to the quality. Like, dude, yeah, DK insane boys are fucking awesome. quality for the price. Yeah. Like, I would always uh, try uh, Jalen's DK deck, and I would be like, "Why did I switch?" <laughs> for real. Every time I'm like, "Dude, I love this deck. Yeah. It, the shape is great. It's like a very good average." Like, again, the working man's fingerboard. It's yeah. It does the job. DK, I'm putting them, I'm putting them, like, for what it is, I'm putting them at the bottom of the A tier. What do you think? I was going to say A as well. Could it go in front of any of these ones? No. I don't think it could. I don't think so. I don't think it could. So, yeah, I think A is. Bottom of the A, they're just, they're great. They're simple. They're affordable. It's, like, the perfect beginner not, not even beginner, like not. I mean both. Both. Like beginner. Anybody or, can use a DK deck. Yeah. They're like DK decks They're great. Are. Okay. Finally, finally, last one. Catfish barbecue. This catfish barbecue is king, baby. Like there's there is no one doing this better than catfish barbecue. Everything that catfish barbecue does is with care. Everything down to the packaging and the stickers. Catfish Barbecue does a lot of like. They do a lot of sculpture Bro, that's work. Fucking sick, dude. <laughs> this, this is just. Is that a rat fish? What I don't is, know. The back? His name's His name's Earl. <laughs> I just I love this type of art, like whatever this is like the we don't fucking care. Like, yeah. This is like the yeah. I really like it. I go back up that green board. <laughs> Fire. Yes. Fire. Catfish Barbecue is, like, really on the line of, like, high-class craftsmanship, but also they don't have to take themselves too seriously. Yeah, yeah. Um, thinking Man, uh, Van Gogh, <laughs> Catfish. Real art. Real art. Yeah. Sculptures. He's taking pictures of these sculptures that he hand-makes, makes them into graphics. They Whoa, did, what's up with the FTP? They did a collab with FTP, bro. That's fucking sick. That's insane. Um, like, that just shows, like, their infiltration into, like, the skate world as well. It's crazy that this exists. Yeah. Like, it's I, insane. I kind of want to see how much they're going for. Their resale value is crazy. Every graphic that Catfish Barbecue comes out with is great. Yeah, it is. It, it really is. is. They are constantly reinventing what they're doing with these graphics. This is a classic, uh art show it's um cool. i just love i this is like such a good logo love it's it. literally a catfish it's a catfish uh her majesty this is also another classic this is one of the first graphics he ever came out with okay. um so it's a little on the nostalgia side of things these are just like look at all these like yeah I like that mixed one media the, on it. the dude everything they're constantly just reinventing what they're doing. This is sick. These just came out. I, think. I know. I really, I really like the yeah, middle one. The the front facing Earl. Yeah, like the sculpture. Um. Yeah. Again, kind of like the other like dumb one and funeral. There is no like set. I mean, I guess you could could consider this as like a stamp logo that you can yeah. just put on anything. But anytime it's implemented, it is done w tastefully, like. This, uh, this like claymation kind yeah. of stuff, like cat, fish, everything is it has a purpose, everything is on the board for a reason. I personally owned this one. I like real, like he's making this, ha he's hand making this, yeah, taking pictures of it. It's real art. There is nothing that tops catfish barbecue down to like the stickers and the packaging it comes with. This is fire.
It's like top tier fingerboard yeah. graphics, probably performance as well. Absolutely. I mean, the saltwater mold is easily the best fingerboard I've ever used in my life. The quality, unmatched. 100% unmatched. Like, they... Catfish is king. Catfish barbecue is king. They're S-tier, baby. There's no one better. <laughs> There's no one better. Damn, no one made it into F-tier? Yeah, I mean, my mom just bought a Mia Tech Tech. It's Might arguably well be worse F-tier. than F, so right. we're just going to do that. <laughs> just get rid of F-tier. <laughs> Bump F-tier up. I mean, yeah, pretty yeah. much. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, that's the list. That's kind of... I just kind of wanted to give a gauge on, like, my thoughts, our thoughts, on the state of, like, fingerboarding. Because, you know, after so many years of so many debt companies coming out, it's hard to differentiate yourself. It's hard to, like, stand out. It's easy to see that most companies are kind of just doing the same thing. Just wanted to give our thoughts on this. Hopefully this was entertaining. This is going to be a long one. Might be a two-parter. But, yeah, that's the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you want to see more stuff like this. It's not a lot, but I appreciate all of you who are tuning in. That's 300 people. That is 300 people. That's like, that could fill up a, a large theater. Yeah. That's pretty cool. People. All right, 300 people. All right, 300 people. Uh, Hopefully that grows <laughs> soon. Uh... <laughs>